How many dinosaurs are excavated per year on average? Is that a measurable statistic? It's not. This is a project that I'm working on. The nearest we can get to that kind of number is how many new genera or species of dinosaurs are published each year. I presented on this at the Society of Vertebrate Paleontology meeting last year. The poster was called The Pace of Dinosaur Discovery. And it's, it's not really the pace of discovery per se, because it's hard to put real numbers on that. What we can put numbers on is uh, how many things get published each year, because that's like a nice discrete date when it gets published. That's, uh, you know, it's easy to get numbers on that. For that project, I was only looking at the past decade, so from 2015 until, at the time, October 2024. On average, there were, I think it was 35.4 new dinosaur species, or dinosaur genera, published each year. So each year, 35 new dinosaurs. Not all of these are going to be valid. There's a lot of caveats like that. Some of these are going to turn out to be this, you know, something that's already been named. Some of them turn out to be dubious, stuff like that. But um, that's the general pace. So it's about one new dinosaur every nine and a half days. Um, the record for that, for the decade was uh, 2019. There were, I think, 47 new dinosaur genera and species published. It's fairly frequently that new dinosaurs get discovered and then it might take years or decades in between the initial discovery and then when the thing finally gets published. So some of these dinosaurs that were published in, say, 2019, they were discovered back in the 70s or 80s. Um, and it took that long to actually get them published. Sometimes these things just languish in a museum drawer until somebody finally has the opportunity to, to really study it in earnest and then publish on it. It looks like this year we are potentially on track for a new record. We've got 30-something new dinosaurs published this year, 2025. And if you, like, kind of project that out to the rest of the year, we will tie or maybe exceed 2019. It'll be 47, maybe 48 new dinosaurs this year. We'll see, you know.